Hello guys, so the physio will be having a wonderful day, if not sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Now today guys, we are continuing with our Pokemon Dark Violet Nuzlocke and it is it. Today's episode, we will be taking on Team Rocket. I mean, we should be taking on Team Rocket because it's Kanto. Oh, that BS. Um, I'm sh I think they have Professor uh, Fuji, not Professor, Mr. Fuji held hostage upstairs from where we are right now. So we're going to have to go and rescue him and also take on this ghost uh, Pokemon, the... Ghost of Mar of Marat. But before we start, we have got a refurbished team after uh, la last episode. That was frustrating and stupid. Like, actually stupid. Like, this game, yes, it's slightly difficult, but you got, like, maybe I'm bad at Pokemon. Maybe it is. But you cannot, like, take away the fact, like, you cannot deny that there is an element of pure bullshit in this game like the way my pokemon have died like shelter one shotted by a ghast a wild ghastly by the way a wild ghastly yeah alteria getting bodied by a haunter like what and then oh it's just annoying really really annoying but yeah anyways refurbished team so we've got becky the muck at level 45 we've got ed sheeran the Fero at level 45 we've got Bad Baby, the Marowak at level 45. We've got Famous Dex, the Miss Magius, or Miss Magius, I don't know how to say it, I think it's Miss Magius. Miss Magius at level 45, and Dyer the Gyarados at level 45. Now, I'm having it rough because I literally have no Pokemon left. I have two Pokemon, which is a Cleffa and a Murkrow. I can't evolve Murkrow because I used the Dust Stone on Mistrevious. So I'm pretty much stuck. I haven't got any good Pokemon or spare Pokemon. And my Pokemon, my team right now is, eh, like, Muck is alright. Gyarados is really good. Uh, Miss Magus, I guess, is okay. These two trash, but Ed Sheeran is is putting in the work. That's what I'm saying. He's putting in the finest of work. But yeah, let, well, let, let's get on with this. Because, oh, get out, leave this place. But yeah. We can run, can't we? Oh, no, no, no. We're just going to have to challenge it again, aren't we? Cool. Goodbye. The ghost was the rest of the spirit of Baby Q-Bone's mother. The very Marowak that Team Rocket killed on Route 10. The mother spirit was calmed. It departed to the afterlife. Damn. Okay, cool. So here we go. Yeah, Team Rocket. All right. Hopefully the, this, there's no BS and we beat whoever's in front of us very easily. There we go. We need bullshit critical kits critical hits on our side here. Yeah. I don't want to get critted. I want them to get critted. Okay. Because the amount of times... Oh. Talking about it just grinds my gears a little bit, but still. Ooh. Ooh. You see, let me, let me tell you something. I know it's not just me. Because I know a lot of Pokemon... Po like, people who play Pokemon probably feel the same way. So you see, does anyone else think that psychic type moves are super effective against ghost type moves? And if that's the case, it is purely because it is because of Gengar, because it's part poison, isn't it? Um, that's literally me. I think that as well. I think that whenever I'm using a ghost type, I feel like the psychic type move is super effective. All the time, I'm just like, oh no no no, that's not super effective. I'm like, oh yeah, <laughs> it's only it's only um thingy. Gengar. I, I know you guys can relate. Because I'm I know I'm not the only one. Like I actually not like I'm 100 percent sure I'm not the only one. But yeah, let me go downstairs because I know there's that little that little area with that aura or whatever it is, that magic to heal me. Alright, let's go through here. Okay, Pokemon's purified. We're gonna keep Dia out first. Because that's just pure power. And we're just going to set up Dragon Dance. Oko every single Pokemon in front of us. Let me check. What moves are physical? We do have physical moves, don't we? Physical, physical. And boost attack. Cool. A Rain Dance as well? Bro. Bro. If we if Gyarados doesn't slap, then I'm going to be shocked. That's all I'm saying. 
I just knew it. No matter what we do, you'll always be there. I'll never understand how you're how you're even alive after what we did to you on the SSN. By messing with us once again, you are putting your life in great danger. I'm going to scare you for good. Alright, cool. Let's hope her team doesn't isn't that good. Executive Ariana. Alright. Okay, that's really good. See, it's really good having an Intimidate Mon. It's really, really useful. Okay, let's Dragon Dance. Yeah, nice try. No. I mean, look. Cool. Now watch. Oh, you gonna die today? This is stab, rain dance boosted, and plus two. If any Pokemon live, I'ma be pissed off. It genuinely is BS if they live. There we go. Critical. Thank you. Yeah, we deserve that after all the bullshit our put our fallen members have gone through. That was for all of you, all of all of our fallen Pokemon. That was for all of you people. Okay. This is kind of scary because I feel like a psychic would actually kill Dyer from here. So please destroy. Yes. Alright, cool. Plus two. Oh, mate. Okay, the rain stopped. Do not destiny bomb me, please. A super repel? No, 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 no. A super potion is what I need. Hypnosis? No. Oh, no. He's going to dream eater. That's going to do a lot. Okay. I'm going to bait him out. 100%. Oh no, wait, what's this? My oh, special defense fell. Oh, no. I need to set up Rain Dance. After here. If he Shadow Balls me again, it's gonna be horrible. Oh my god, I can't. I need a Hyper Potion. And this is the last Pokemon. Oh, come on. It doesn't need to be this hard on the last Mon. Like, come on. Okay, please. Oh my god. I feel like she's gonna use Shadow Ball and just destroy that. Yes! I know I'm quicker. Have that. That's got to kill. Goodbye. Ugly. Ugly. Goodbye. Oh my days. You know what? I'm just battling with frustration every battle after the. Oh. After the past like two or three episodes. Oh my days. Why are we here, you ask? I guess I'll tell you that much. Mr. Fuji has information on the legendary Pokemon. Oh, here's Daisy. Oh, it saved the day, Daisy. Oh, what's she gonna do? I'm putting an end to you, your crimes. You fucks are planning to take over the Kanto region, and I will not allow that. And how? And who? And who might you be? My name is Daisy. Oh, sorry. I'm the granddaughter of Professor Oak, and I'm the new gym leader of Viridian City. I will take you down with my Earth-loving Pokemon. <laughs> You're the gym leader of Viridian City? What a pitiful replacement you are. <laughs> okay, wow. My time as the gym leader of Viridian City was getting in the way of plans of Four Canto, so I resigned that position. I've always wondered who my successor was going to be. I must say, I am disappointed. I'll step aside, Daisy. Let me speak to your friend, Soda. Soda, I'm quite surprised that you, you continue to oppose my organization after I revealed the Devil's Prism to you. Do you realize how much power I will attain once the Devil's Prison can can control the legendary Pokemon? Surely you do not want to be punished when it when the time comes. Unfortunately for you, you are a bit late in coming here. I have obtained more information on the, I've obtained more info I was losing the voice there. <laughs> I've obtained more information on the legendary Pokemon thanks to Mr. Fuji. My work here is done. Stay out of trouble, Soda. Soda, I'm so sorry I was late. At least Team Rocket finally left. And yes, I was telling the, that woman the truth. I am the new gym leader of Viridian City. I'm heading to Viridian R City right now. It would make my day if I was your fifth gym leader match. There, I've healed your Pokemon. You better stop by, huh? Smell you later. Wait. So wait, Viridian isn't the last? Okay, okay. What was Kamon's voice? It was similar to Giovanni's. Hmm. Mr. Fuji. 
Please tell me about Deoxys and its relation to Buff Island. <clears throat> All right then. There is many. There is a mysterious triangular stone tablet that lies on Buff Island. According to the prophecy of the triangular stone tablet, when any remnant remnant of certain space virus is taken to Buff Island, the stone tablet will produce a laser beam that will create De Deoxys' missing body. So. If one, if, if one were to find a rem remnant of that space virus, would Buff Island be the only way to restore the oxys? Not necessarily. If one were to find a way to harness the same type of materials found on Buff Island, they would be able to replicate the same kind of laser beam. Mr. Fuji, Giovanni is working on a machine called the Devil's Prism. I'm positive that the sole purpose of the Devil's Prism is to create the laser beam that will restore the oxys body. If Giovanni were to obtain the oxys, it would unleash great pain upon the citizens of Kanto. He must be stopped at all costs. Yes, yes. I understand the severity of this situation. However, if you are trying to stop Team Rocket alone, I must say that I am worried for you. I have observed you th observed that you don't treat your Pokemon with much care. If you carry on like that, you can't possibly stand up to Team Rocket. Giovanni is very powerful even without Deoxys. A long time ago when Giovanni was just 16 years old, it was giving his first Pokemon by Professor Oak. Giovanni travelled through the Kanto region and defeated the gym leaders of that time and he even went on to challenge the Elite Four. As champion of the Kanto region, I battled him and was impressed by his great skill. I offered him a position as the gym leader of Viridian City, so to which he accepted. <coughs> Wait, my throat. Hold on, I can't do this. Hold on. Alright. And he held that position until only recently. Giovanni is a powerful man, and a young boy such as yourself does not stand a chance. Now, if you will excuse me, I would like to thank someone. Ah, oh, salt in the wounds. <laughs> you came to save me. Thank you. But I came here of my own free will. I was never taken hostage. That was just a scare tactic by Team Rocket. I must. I came here to calm the spirit of Cubone's mother, to which Team Rocket found out and infiltrated the tower to get m information out of me. Giovanni wanted to contact me because he knew I was involved in a terrible accident that occurred 13 years ago. I don't think I've introduced to you, myself to you yet. Call me Mr. Fuji. I'm the current champion of the Kanto region. What? Okay. Okay, Dark Violet. I'll give that. I'll give. I'll give that. Dark Violet is very different to the original Kanto re, uh, games. But I'm retiring in order to spend more time caring for orphan. Okay, I didn't get through the last bit. I must thank you for calming Marowak's spirit. I think she knows by now that Cubon is in good hands. This might be of use to you. Cool, with that we can actually get Snorlax. We can get Snorlax. I think after this we'll go and catch it and call it a wrap. The Pokeflu can be used to wake up any sleeping Pokemon. It might even be able to wake up the Snorlax that snor the snor that's blocking Diglett's cave near Vermilion City. Alas, my purpose here is done. I wish you good luck on the rest of your journey. Do visit me at my home sometime. It is right here in Lavender Town. I'll visit you straight after this. Don't worry, bro. Hmm. <laughs> that Fuji guy is the champion. He told me that I need to treat my Pokemon better. <laughs> if only he knew what my po what what my life was like. Soda, I challenge you once again. This time, I won't lose. Boy, I better beat this guy. I swear. Kabutops. Cool. We do. I'm not gonna set up at rain dance because that will be an advantage of with he, he he can potentially take advantage of that. Oh, he's got rock type moves. Let me let me just body him quick. Uh. Hold on. Porygon two, boy. You try smart intimidate. <laughs> no. Oh. I need. Bro. Bro. I'm so lucky. That is overpowered. After every boomerang I heal, that is overpowered. <laughs> that is low key broken, I can't even lie. I push me. Signal Beam does quite a bit, I can't lie. Ooh, that was a juicy hit. So was that two times? Do you mean two times? I swear boomerang hits more. Or am I just bugging? 
Fan attack. Let's go. Alright, cool. The shovel coming in. I mean, I don't even know. It's just restoring two HP. But hey, hey, any kind of HP, whoa, will make a difference. Giga impact. Hello? But you have to recharge, isn't it? It's really damaging. Uh, nah, I can't. I can't. My moveset is decent. I'll replace Thingy with Ice Beam. But. Ice Fang with Ice Beam. Alteria. I'll happily battle an Alteria with Dire. I'm gonna use Becky. I'm gonna use Becky. And I'm a setup as well. Oh no. Okay. Oh, we've got a nugget. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell that once I finish. Uh, where's the awakening? Awakening is here. Yeah, you're gonna miss all your things now. You're almost definitely gonna miss all your things. Critical hit. Boy, you need to chill. There you go. Cool. I'm gonna screech you as well. So why not? Two crits in a row? Or are you taking the piss? And uh, let's have a potion. You <sighs> sludge bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep, keep using sync because you're literally not going to hit. Nice. Get the poison. That's why I love sludge bomb. It's got like a thirty percent chance to poison. I actually love that move. It's such a clutch poison type move. For me, my favorite move is actually Toxic, you know. I actually love Toxic. Love using it. It's so, it again, clutch move. Need a Reno. Should I just stay out and just troll this Need a Reno? <laughs> I'm fully minimized as well. I missed as well. Okay. <laughs> my special attack, bro. You're a fool, bro. How are you gonna. <laughs> You're a fool. Oh man, you're actually a fool. Like, I'm lowering your your, your maxed low. You literally you're at minus six special defense, and you're gonna increase my special attack, boy. <laughs> and I, oh, bro, this fool, <laughs> bro. I'm just mucking around with this guy. Finally, we actually get to muck a vow and not take a battle seriously, yeah? Oh, my days. I swear, every battle is going to be like this. I have to set up. I literally have to set up. Because some, some of the trainers are just frustrating. Hmm, whatever. At least Team Rocket has consistently proved how pathetic they are. Giovanni is never going to succeed at catching the legendary Pokemon. Just you wait. So he actually is against Team Rocket. Okay. So it looks like Shiny was actually right. Uh, where's the escape rope? Did I just, I did just go past it, didn't I? Yeah. Cool, I think we're gonna... Should we leave Snorlax for the next episode? Yeah, we're gonna leave Snorlax for the next episode. Alright, cool. That's the end of today's episode. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to hit the like button below. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you're new here and you want to see more Pokemon content like this. And be sure to comment down below if you enjoyed. Be sure to follow me on the socials as well. Follow my Twitter, like my Facebook page. All of that will be linked in the description below as well as the Pokemon Dark Violet Nuzlocke playlist if you did miss out any episodes. And yeah, once again, thank you guys ever so much for watching. Hope you all have a wonderful day.